It's a story. Story of a teenage girl. Suddenly, the sunshine of her life dimmed, and she went to an unknown world beyond her imagination. All her dreams became nightmares. As time passed by, her misery increased. Then one day, she got her old life back. My husband was a little bit of a gate. I had a lot of customers. I had a lot of money. 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 I had a lot of Many women and children of the southern part of Bangladesh has been experiencing similar stories. Bangladesh is not only a source but also used as one of the transit routes for human trafficking. Poverty, unemployment, lack of awareness, child marriage and polygamy plays a vital role for this problem. Similarly, the massive expansion of sex trade and easy border crossing to access the situation has increased human trafficking. These trafficked women and children face the ultimate and incredible catastrophe of their lives. They are compelled to get involved in criminal activities as well as sex slavery. The fortunate ones get a chance to escape, but they can't easily reconcile with their beloved family and society. So, many of them prefer to go back in the world of darkness again. To prevent trafficking of women and children, World Vision Bangladesh, an international non-profit Christian humanitarian and development organization, initiated a five-year-long child safety net project in 2011. The project aimed at reducing the risk of women and child trafficking and to create a protective environment for children. To achieve these goals, the project has contributed to the children and families, those who are at risk of trafficking and to rehabilitate the survivors into the normal life. <laughs> সার্বিক সহযোগিতা প্রদান করেছে বিশেষ ভাবে তাদেরকে পুনর্বাসিত করেছেন তাদের পরিবারে এবং সমাজে The project has been financed by World Vision USA, Canada and Hong Kong and has worked effectively at 9 districts and 25 upazilas of Khulna, Borishal and Dhaka. Bangladesher dokkhin pashchimancholer bisheshore tinti bibhag Kulna, Borishal ebong Dhakar kichu angsho. Mood shatta jela ebong duita city corporation er pochista upojale tadher karjokram pori chalona kore. The project has mainly prioritized three objectives: prevention, protection, and restoration. And advocacy was one of the vital strategies of the project. Preventative programs have helped people to aware about the exploitation, abuse and deprivation of children. As part of this, group discussion or courtyard meeting has been arranged and street drama, documentary shows have been screened also. Child-friendly space, life skill based education training and income generating activities have been covered under the protection program. <laughs> Protection program has coordinated with like-minded public and private institutions, social organizations, civil society, law enforcement agencies, journalists and representatives and organized various workshops, meetings, seminars and dialogues. 
This played an effective role in the prevention of trafficking of women and children. Under restoration program, the project provided rehabilitation support to the survivors, including educational materials, medical support, counseling, income generating and vocational training, and input support to create opportunities to live a normal life. উদ্ধার হওয়ার পর তো সব কিছুই আমার ওয়ার্ড পিছন থেকে সাহায্য করেছে যেরকম কাপড় চাপড় দিয়া মদির দোকান দিয়া চিকিৎসা হওয়া তারপরে মেয়ের চিকিৎসা হওয়া সব কিছুই ওয়ার্ড পিছন আমার উদ্ধার হওয়ার পরে ওয়ার্ড পিছন দিয়ে সাহায্য করছে থ্রু অ্যাডভোকেসি ইনিশিয়েটিভস দ্য প্রজেক্ট হ্যাজ ওয়ার্ক সাকসেসফুলি উইথ गवर्नमेंट এন্ড নন गवर्नमेंट অর্গানাইজেশনস It provided assistance in implementing the Prevention and Suppression Act 2012 and National Plan of Action for Preventing Trafficking and Child Marriage. It also aimed to create a safer environment for children. The project has changed many lives. Many trafficked victims are now able to live their life with dignity and pride. হারিয়ে যাওয়ার পর যখন ফিরে এসেছি ভালোভাবে নতুন জীবন করছি লেখাপড়া করছি সেই লেখাপড়া দেখে সরকার আমাকে খুশি হয়ে উপজেলা পর্যায়ে জেলা পর্যায়ে এবং বিভাগীয় পর্যায়ে পুরস্কার দিয়েছে Even though the project is phased out It has formed 46 counter trafficking committees, 34 network bodies with non-government organizations and 20 child friendly spaces to maintain sustainability and stability of the project. This will continue the activities of Child Safety Net project in future. Project ta chole gele hoyto eta ashongka ache je counter trafficking holo kaaj korbe kina. Tobe amra khubi committed ei bishoye যে কমিটিগুলো কাজ করছে আমরা এগুলোকে থেমে থাকতে দেব না আমরা এটাকে ঠিক প্রাতিষ্ঠানিক ভিত্তিতে দাঁড় করাতে চাচ্ছি আমাদের খুলনা বিভাগে একটা ওয়াচডক নেটওয়ার্ক অ্যান্টি ট্রাফিকিং কাউন্টার ট্রাফিকিং কমিটি আমরা করেছি যে কমিটিগুলো উপজেলা নির্বাহী অফিসার জেলা প্রশাসকদের নেতৃত্বে গঠিত হয়েছে সেখানে পুলিশ বিভাগ সহ সমাজের বিভিন্ন মানুষরা আছেন তাদের দায়িত্ব দেওয়া হয়েছে যাতে এই নারী শিশু পাচারের কোনো ঘটনা না ঘটে Many people have contributed for last 5 years to make this project successful. We acknowledge their support and sincere cooperation. 1.6 million people have been reached through the Child Safety Net project. We need to recognize World Vision Canada, Hong Kong, and especially World Vision United States for their big-hearted funding for the Child Safety Net project. We want every child to be free. and enjoy life in all its fullness. We dream children will grow up with confidence in a child-friendly environment. The future is waiting for them. <laughs>